This is what's happening now on WDSU News at 4. Fall is here and that means runners all over the city are gearing up to pound the pavement. Now some people are worried running can actually damage your knees, but it really may have the opposite effect. Six is on call this afternoon. We're joined by Toro orthopedist Dr. Kevin Watson. Doctor, going against the grain a little bit, can you tell us how running can be actually good for your knees? There's recent evidence to suggest that actually continuous exercise can actually be protective to the knee. Regular exercise can actually condition the cartilage and the ligaments in your knee that can actually prevent uh, further degeneration and pain down the line. Now, Dr. Watson, who should take caution before running and how can damage to the knees actually be prevented? Certainly patients or people who have had previous injuries to their knee should definitely take caution when they begin any type of running program. Injuries can occur when there's abnormal load across the cartilage or the ligaments of the knee. It can also upset the balance of the knee, and that can lead to pain and degeneration. To help prevent injuries in the knee, the best program is likely a strengthening program of the muscles around the knee, which can also uh, reduce the impact that your knees see while running. And doctor, do you see the knee damage increase with age? It's a common myth that uh, people should stop running once they reach the age of 40. Actually, a recent study out of Stanford University showed that runners even over the age of 40 who ran regularly actually had less arthritis, pain, and degeneration in their knees than those who did not run. So there's really no evidence to suggest that running on healthy knees will lead to further pain. Well, Dr. Kevin Watson, thank you for joining us from Tour. And remember, you can watch more of our on-call segments on your home computer by logging on to WDSU.com.